Hello everyone, and welcome back to Leftover Currency. Today, we'll be going through the top five scariest banknotes in the world. Be it hidden symbols, ghosts, murderers, unsolved mysteries, or horrible deaths. These banknotes are seriously spooky. Carry on watching at your own risk. At number five, we have a banknote that everyone is familiar with the one American dollar banknote. But you may not be so familiar with this. If you look closely on the one dollar bill banknote, you'll see there are several references to the number 13. The number 13 is considered very unlucky in some countries, and Friday the 13th is considered especially unlucky. I think there's actually a scary movie called Friday the 13th. Some hotels don't have a 13th floor, and some airlines don't have a 13th row, because they're both considered so unlucky. So. Let's explore the features of this banknote that refer to the number 13. First, we have the eagle on the back of the banknote, holding 13 arrows. Then, we have the branch in the eagle's left claw, which has 13 leaves and 13 fruits. The shield in front of the eagle also has 13 horizontal bars, and there are also 13 stars above the eagle. The text on the banknote, E Pluribus Unum and Annua Coeptus, both have 13 letters. And lastly, the pyramid has 13 steps. It is believed that the $1 bill has 13 references to the number 13, and lots of theories exist about what the remaining ones are. Maybe you can find the missing ones. The fourth scariest banknote on our list is the 50 Austrian shilling banknote. Now you may be wondering, what's so scary about this banknote when all it has is a portrait of Ferdinand Raymond, an actor born in 1790 Vienna? Well, we selected this bill as the fourth scariest banknote because of the horrific way this man died. Age 46, Raymond was bitten by a wild dog. Although the flesh wound was very gory, it didn't kill him. However, Raymond believed the dog to be rabid. Rabies is a horrible and viral disease that causes death within three months. Raymond decided to take matters into his own hands and took a rifle and shot himself in the mouth. But the bullet bounced off the inside of his head and deflected, thus missing his brain entirely. He then went on to live for another five whole days, tormented by the excruciating pain from the gunshot wound to his head, after which he died from his injuries. After Raymond died, it turned out the dog was not rabid. Third place in our list of scariest banknotes, the haunting scene on the back of the 100 Swiss franc banknote showing the Grim Reaper and three of his victims. First of all, let's go into a bit of detail about who the Grim Reaper is. For thousands of years, various cultures have had figures to represent death, and one of the most common and enduring of these is the Grim Reaper, most commonly seen as a skeletal figure, who is often shrouded in a dark hooded robe, and carrying a scythe to reap human souls. A bit like what you can see on the back note. The victims show an old man, a young woman, and a young child. The left hand corner also shows an hourglass, making it clear that our days are numbered. When the sand runs out, our time is up. Could you be the Grim Reaper's next victim? So, the second scariest banknote in the world is the 75 Pfennig Überwammergau German Notgeld. Now, you might not have heard of this, but don't worry, you'll definitely know about it by the end of this video. In 1920s Germany, the economy was in major crisis and inflation was high. Many towns and cities started issuing their own emergency money, not Geld, in German. The design of these emergency banknotes often give away the fact that they were issued during times of economic and political crisis, such as this banknote issued by the town of Oberwammergau, featuring the bubonic plague. On this banknote, a giant grim reaper is featured mowing the town with a scythe. The year printed on the banknote is 1634, which is when the bubonic plague death rate finally went down. The villagers vowed to God that if he spared them from the plague, they would produce a passion play every 10 years, illustrating the life and death of Jesus. The first passion play was performed in 1634, and is still being performed to this day, most recently in 2010. Now, the number one spot for the scariest banknote that we've chosen is Chinese hell money. That's right, it's actually called Hell Money. Printed by commercial companies, these Hell banknotes have no legal tender value, at least not in this world. They are meant to be spent by the dead in the afterlife. Living relatives offer Hell Money to the dead by burning these banknotes or placing them in the coffin of the deceased. 
The practice is common to the ancient Greek Charon's obol, a coin placed in or on the mouth of a dead person before they are buried. The obol coin is meant to pay Charon, the fairy man of the underworld. The Chinese believe that hell money should be offered to the dead so they can bribe Yama, the king of hell, for a shorter stay there or to escape hell altogether. Also, in Chinese mythology, the numbers on the hell banknotes are often very high, most commonly 10 million. This guarantees that the deceased can live a lavish afterlife. We hope you've enjoyed our video on the world's most scariest banknotes of all time. If you have a suggestion for other scary banknotes, feel free to let us know by dropping us a comment below. Please drop us a like and subscribe if you haven't already, so you won't miss another one of our thrilling episodes. Thanks everyone. Bye for now.